What's up guys, I'm Random Frank P, back with the third installment of using a blank for gaming. In the first video, we used an actual pilot aviation headset for gaming. Then in the second video, we used a laser projected keyboard in Counter-Strike. This time around, we're gonna be using an N64 controller, one of the first controllers I've ever used years ago. And we're gonna see if we can use this on my PC. Now taking a look at it, obviously it is an exact replica of an original N64 controller, but since this is made for a PC, we have the RetroLink logo up top, not the Nintendo branding. And it's going to connect to our PC via a USB port. I picked this up from Banggood for dirt cheap, and it is pretty much exactly the same. We have all these same buttons and controls here. We got the little bumpers up top, the trigger in the back. So I'm going to hook it up to my PC, see if we can use it for games like Counter-Strike, and just see how this thing works overall. Okay, so... Got it all booted up here. I went and downloaded the drivers for this and already remapped the buttons in the game so I can actually use it because you guys all bitched at me last time for not doing that. So I have it all booted up. All the controls are set. Let's start it off. We're going to try it against bots first, then go online. All right, so the joystick is to look and move around. The D-pad over here is to walk. And we got the trigger to shoot in the back. This, uh, the left bumper is going to switch weapons. And up and down over here, we'll crouch and jump. That's pretty much all I know, but at least we got it working. Right, oh, oh, I see one. I see one. Ready? Come on. Come on. Where, do you, where the hell did he go? Oh. Whoop. Oh. Come on. Move, move. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, get fucked, Josh. You did. Okay, so it's actually a lot easier than I thought to move around and aim and walk. It's pretty, it's, it's pretty good. I'm not, I'm not going to lie. So the D-pad definitely isn't the easiest thing to use to walk around, but I don't mind the uh, the joystick here. Wait, oh, oh, right in the face. Damn, Nick, you just ate some lead. All right, going upstairs, going to check it out, survey the area. You know, I'm feeling pretty comfortable already just playing against bots. Uh, oh, 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 yeah, Steve, fucking Steve, get out of here. Such a classic Steve. Oh, oh, ah, ah. It's, it's definitely harder to control in the heat of the moments. But you know what? I'm feeling pretty comfortable against bots. Let's, let's go online after I shoot this guy in the ass. Is it Steve again? Oh, damn. Ian just walked in front of that. Let's go online. All right, so we're just thrown in the heat of the battle here. Let's see how this controller can stack up when we're playing it against actual people and not just medium bots. All right, I see someone creeping. See someone creeping. Oh, oh, the doctor. You're going to need to see a doctor because you have a fucking puncture wound in your mouth. Nope. Don't know how to open the door. Not good. Oh, oh, nope. See, I, in the heat of the moment, I just freak out and I aim down or something. He's peeking out the window. Who am I getting shot by? Oh, you over there. I can't aim that good with this. Oh, it's definitely hard to aim at things farther away. Definitely better for like enemies up close. Oh, yeah. Yeah, French gabber. All right, so I'm actually not doing too bad. Two kills, like four deaths, but hey, not bad for using a controller against people who are using mouse and keyboard, let alone an N64 controller. Oh, right in the cock. French gabber. Oh, all right. <laughs> oh, man. I'm so oh, 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 man. Oh, man. I killed the enemy leader. With an N64 controller, you just got it right to the chest. Come on, can we get two in a row? Oh, shit. How do I aim? Oh, ah, ah, fuck. Oh, my God. I got him. They should be embarrassed right now. Oh, guy up top, guy up top. Oh, oh my God. Accurate. Ah, oh, it's over. It's over. I did pretty good. I started mid-round. I finished above two people. I went 12 into 14. Using an N64 controller, 12 and 14, not bad at all. All right, so we're back in another Counter-Strike game. This time from the beginning, match is just starting now. So we're going to see how I do with a full game using the controller. Peekaboo, 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 all oh, right in the chest. I got two kills there. That was a double kill. Three, uh, oh, three, we're on a roll. We are on a roll. We're starting off this game good. Starting off good. Walking through like I own the place because I have an N64. Oh, how did I not get the kill for that? Come on. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh my god. You can't handle this. You just can't. Oh, okay. Okay. 
praise rain, he can he can maybe handle it. I just got knifed twice in a row. Everyone's taking my kills. I was at about four, now I'm down to two already. Oh. This guy's sitting at the top of the stairwell reading magazines. Eat that. Right in the face. I'm gonna go downstairs. Look at this guy. Oh shit, I'm gonna hide. He didn't see me. He didn't see me. Where is he? Should I knife him? Oh, I totally could have knifed him. Totally could have knifed him. Oh, right in the nuts, dude. He disappeared. I was gonna teabag him. If you get teabagged by a guy using an N64 controller, that's just bad for you. You gotta reevaluate your life. Ooh, yeah, right in the chest. Welcome to Cleveland. Welcome to hell. <laughs> uh, oh, 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 got you, got you. Oh, oh, that didn't get you. Somebody walk through these doors so I could just l ah. Well, let's see how we did. Not as good as I hoped. We started out real strong. 19 and 22. So only negative three again. 19 kills though, with this controller, not too bad. It's certainly not easy. Aiming is not easy at all. But I'll take 19 and 22 against people using a mouse and keyboard when I'm using this. All right guys, so there you have it. We used the N64 controller on my PC. And once I got the buttons remapped and all that stuff, it worked pretty decently. Uh, worked a lot better than I thought it would. It had more control than I thought, which is always a good thing. So can you use this for PC gaming? Yes, but what I recommend it Probably not. Maybe if you have like a uh, an N64 ROM, I wouldn't use this for competitive gaming. Obviously, that'd be just dumb. Uh, but I'll put the link for this in the description down below. It's from Banggood if you want to pick it up. Again, I got it for dirt cheap, and the quality of it is definitely pretty good. Had some nostalgia when I was playing these games with the controller. So I, overall, I had a pretty good time. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up to show your support. And make sure to drop a comment down below. Tell me what you want to see me play uh, next on the next series. Like, like, give me some ideas. I don't know. I've been trying to think of things. I have a, a trackball mouse. That's a pretty good idea that I've heard. Uh, just drop your comments down below on some things you want to see me use in the next video. Feel free to follow me on Twitter at RandomFrankP. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. You're not going to want to miss on any tech reviews or tech videos I got coming up real soon. Well, I'm RandomFrankP. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day.